opened in 1972. It was originally opened as a breeding facility before it happened. We opened the white line recently. This line is going across the top of the valley over the animal's head. It's a lot of fun. I've done it myself and recommend it. So there. The uh, polar bear over there on the left. Yeah. And uh, brings up a good point. Trying to study an animal's biology and behavior in the wild is very difficult. The zoo allows for close scientific monitoring of animals and their habitat. What? Our conservation science facility. Oh, really tipping around there. It's new on the exhibit. As you can tell, they have uh, oh. <laughs> some interaction there. <laughs> On the left, I said on the right now, we have uh, the Calamian deer, deadly to the Philippines. And after that, the sleek and elegant southern deer nut. Up ahead, we have the sky, sorry, west entrance. The, uh, you can ride the sky sorry, for $4 one way or all day long for free. On ahead here. Yeah, uh, Let's get a new mask. Okay, man. They're like. By the way, is a non profit organization. So, uh, we appreciate everybody's time. A young, fine, furry friend here is the Sejuan Tonkin. It comes from the same area of China as the giant pandas. It's not well known outside of China.